Another beautiful baseball day here at Nationals Park. We have a one o'clock matinee for you today. He could have gone under the turnstile. Great uni. He's ready for some daytime baseball. Well, this kid's quite a hitter on base in this series four times. Nats have limited him to one hit. Three walks, but Robinson Cano's 0 for 9. So gave up three runs in four and a third on six hits. Struck out three Dodgers. Walked two through 89 pitches. Over the Braves, who beat St. Louis. Popped up. Left side, Anthony Rendon. Glove for shade into foul ground for the first out of the game. Everything working well behind Corbin last night. Swing and a miss on the off speed. So a foul out and a strikeout to start. Right side and Howie makes a play at second base. Robles and Ren don't follow him, but Adam, look at these numbers. Nine for 15 against Zach Wheeler. Three walks. Starts. But the last two starts for Zach, he's been dialed in. 21 strikeouts and just two walks in his last two. Little tapper off to the left side on the charge. J.D. Davis with the bare hand. Safe is the call. And the Mets are going to have a look at it. Nicky Calloway had his right arm up just as Tony Randazzo. One and two to Robles with Eaton aboard. Left side perfectly placed. So Eaton and Robles the last two nights four for four getting on base in the first inning in the first inning at the bank. 0 oh, two to Rendon. He's going to drop one into left center. Eaton reads it and scores. Robles reads it and goes over to third. A lot like what these three did last night and the Nats are on the board immediately. Way inside and the bases are loaded for Howie Kendrick. Line moving. Busted bat, slow roller, a run scores. Mets will turn a 6-4-3, and the Nats lead 2-0. Put the ball in play. 2-1 to Parra. He's going to check one to right center. One hopping the scoreboard, and the Nats do lead 3-0 again. Every one of his hits have meant something. A game-winning grand slam. It's been like when you released it, and it seems hittable. That ball is crushed in the corner off the top of the wall. Para scores Suzuki into second for nothing Nationals. Get the cage just do some drills get loose. And Wheeler's got it. So he's going to go 30 pitches in the first inning this time. One and two. Got him. Conforto gave up on it. Sanchez gets the edge. Well hit the other way. Eaton to his right to cut it off. Momentary bobble gets it right back. He's going again. Ball four. He's hurt. Uh oh. Gerardo Paro is raving, waving out Paul Lassard right now. Something's going on. He'll pitch an inning and a third, two strikeouts, a base hit, and then something happened either during the walk to Nimmo or before. But so fifth ball game, he's appeared in this series. He had two scoreless innings, pitching well in the seventh and the eighth here in the 6 2 loss on. Up the middle, Defoe to the bag and the throw wide, and it pulls Parra off the base. 12 6 action right there. Swing and a miss on a ball that ends up well outside. So Fetty comes on and gets two batters just ahead of Chris Sale. Passed him up last night. Robles high in the air, right field, Conforto. A couple of quick outs for Wheeler here in the second. Mile high out to center, Brandon Nimmo. Zach Wheeler just got what he needed a quick recovery second inning. Zach Wheeler and Eric Fetty top of the third. He's going to drop one over Anthony Rendon. Zach Wheeler gets the Mets second hit. Up the middle that's going to be too quick for Kendrick to get to it. 
McNeil had enough topspin on that ball to get it through. Had him out ahead. Para to short. Defoe's return throw, not in time. Wheeler to third. That ball is driven to left center. Keeps tailing away from Robles. Hops on the track and goes into the bullpen. Smith might have been able to score on that had it stayed in play, and now it's a 4 1 game. Shift on. He's going to lift one high in the air to deep right. Adam Eaton watching it. And just like that, this game is tied. Four run lead vanishing. And that's going to be Adam Eaton rushing in to grab it. How to speed up the game, call more strikes. How do you do that? Swing and a miss. And how he not real happy as he go back and goes. Ballpark back. will be buzzing. A lot of Cubby fans will be here. So come on out and make some noise for your Nats. Gerardo Paris two for two fights one off and it drops into left. Suzuki stings it again off the glove of Rosario. Para heading for third. It's two of the hardest hit balls for Kurt Suzuki in one game this year. Defoe can't quite get it in play and the Nats will strand a couple. Three left in the first three innings of a. Pretty deep out to left center and Robles spotting it catching up with it. Fetty bounces back with a one two three. Top of the fourth. Two and one to Sanchez. I tell you this kid's had some good at bats. He's come off the bench with several pinch hits. And Adrian's aboard with the Nats. Eaton a foul tip. Strikeout number three for Wheeler, and they've all come in the third and fourth innings. Even though it's the fourth inning, did you go after Rendon? I guess you go after Rendon. Yeah, he's going to jam him. Left side, J.D. Davis, and the Nats are gone in the fourth inning. So for Jennings, appearance number seven, five earned runs, six overall, six hits in three innings. Got him. Lagares gave up on it, and the slider came back to get him. Fastball paints Perfect. outside edge. And he's locked up on that one to strike out. Number four for Zach Wheeler. Had him reaching this one near the right field line. Hard play for somebody and it falls in fair. Then it spins foul. Michael Conforto down. The concussion protocol questions being asked right there. He, he's got to come out of this game, doesn't he? Thank goodness they're taking him out. Para to right. Well hit. Still going. See you later. Bullpen. His second as a net. And it's a 6 4 game. Swing and a miss. Two down. Broxton, Davis, and Nimmo, 16th ball game. Got inside on him, and Soto tracking it. Good pitch by Miller. Got him looking. Miller right in there, two down. Mets bullpen busy. Michael A levels off and hits it by the shortstop. He's going to make a big round to the back there. Strike three call on the outer edge or thereabouts. 
to left. Right at Nimmo and the Nats are done in the sixth. 21st appearance. Roughed up by the Dodgers last time out. That's pretty good approach by their number seven hitter Rosario. Third hit of the series his first today he's aboard. Out to center but he didn't get it. Strong throw to third by Robles offline. You know it was kind of weird just as that ball was in the air. Swing and a miss. And that's a big run to strand a third for Calvert. Daniel Zamora. Seventh appearance. No runs one hit three and two thirds for the Mets so far. Four K's couple of guy in the ballpark and Matt Adams from Slippery Rock. Look at Soto way out in front of the plate. But he bunted it too close to the line and he's tagged by Dominic Smith. Resrix. Another nasty breaking ball two out so here he comes. I walked him on four. Boo. Boo. Yeah, you pronounce it just how it looks. 18th appearance. 24 hits in 25 innings, eight earned runs, and the he's going. Pitches over the plate, and that throw tails up and away to Cano. And Gerardo Parra rips his first bag as a net. Suzuki. Right center, it's dropping. Par around the bag. He will score. Seven for Nationals. And Suzuki with a three hit day. And now he will. That's a pretty close take by Brian Dozier. That was close, man. Eaton in the air, left field line. Can anybody get there? Left fielder does Nimmo and that's it for the Nats little guy that arrived after being released by the Giants and say that. Well hit to left. Robinson Cano a two for four day ball's going to spin into foul ground and he's going to stay at first base. This one stung out to center. It comes tailing right to where Victor Robles was playing. When the pitch was delivered, two down. Right side, Dozier in for defense, has it. That's it for the Mets in the top of the eighth. Watching a ball game on a beautiful day. Bottom eight coming up. Tyler Bachelor. Check swing left side on the run, Davis. Got a hurry. Out is the call. By Tony Randazzo. Boy, he was screaming down the line. Victor Robles. You waiting your team where you're at. Rendon to left. Didn't get it. Waiting for it, Nimmo. Two down. Season trying to get him out of there. I think they're going in right here. Strike three call. It is a safe situation. Check out the ERA and the strikeouts to walks. And the opponent's average. Pretty good at bat by a 198 hitter against a tough lefty. Swing, a tip, and a strikeout. One down. Huge. Frazier to left. Well hit. Soto off the wall above him. Nemo had to hold around second base. So the runners are at second and third, and Wilson Ramos will represent the tying run. Wilson Ramos against Sean Doolittle two for three career. That's a base hit. It's going to be seven to five. And they're attacking early in the count. These guys off the bench. That's a base hit. Now it's seven to six. Ramos had to stop at second. Popped him up left side Rendon under it infield fly rule in effect and a huge second out. I'll tell you what we're not used to drama with Sean Doolittle he spoiled us all. Tough play 
Defoe knocks it down, keeps it on the infield, and the bases are loaded. <laughs> Tying runs at third base. Quite an at bat by Cano down 0 2. Swing and a miss. Everybody exhale. How big can two out of three be on the 16th of May for the Nets?